Hi, I'm David Schmidt with Adobe, and I'd like to show an example of how Adobe Experience Manager Mobile can be used to create a dynamic mobile app which combines enterprise integrations with easy content and user experience updates. This particular demo is a sales enablement app for pharmaceutical reps, but while you watch, think about how this could be slightly modified for a different use case or industry. Let's assume I'm a sales rep going out on a sales call to visit Dr. Simpson. If I switch over to my iOS Contacts app, I don't see any information about Dr. Simpson here. So let's switch back to our AM mobile app, and let's search this nicely designed Doctor Finder, which is synced with our CRM system. Here's Dr. Simpson. If I just tap the Add button, we can see an example of how AM Mobile lets you extend your app using Cordova APIs, taking advantage of device capabilities like adding CRM data to the native iOS Contacts app. Back in our AN mobile app, we can bring up a dynamic map to see where we need to go to visit this client. Once we are on site with this doctor, we can present information to her, such as this article about our latest innovations. This is an AAM templated article, and I'll show you how we can easily update this in a bit. During our meeting, we can take notes about the doctor's interest to inform future sales calls. Here's a quick note. This gets stored on our device as well as pushed up to our CRM system. Next, let's browse our product catalog shoulder to shoulder with our client and place some orders in real time. Dr. Simpson wants to purchase this blood test. Let's make our selections here. She's also interested in these bandages. Now we can see a summary of our order and submit this directly to our order management system. Okay, now let's step back and look at all the ways that my sales enablement team back at headquarters can easily update this app. This is our AM dashboard for the app. The products in the product catalog were loaded into AM Commerce from our product information management system. Let's import some newly added products into the app. These products flow directly into AM articles using predefined templates. We're now uploading these new articles to AM Mobile On Demand Services for distribution to the app. Next, we'll add these new product articles to the product guide collection so that they appear in the right place in our app. All right, next, let's see how easy it is to update one of the innovation articles that our sales reps present to clients. Here's how we can update the article text and images using AM content fragments. Content fragments are very useful when content is being repurposed across multiple channels, such as a website and a mobile app. Now we simply upload the article to on-demand services. Okay, that's done. Next, let's switch over to AM Mobile On Demand Services and see how we can easily update the user experience of the app. This is a handy content map to see the live information architecture of our app. Let's go ahead and update the layout template for our latest innovations section. This is a live preview of the layout for this app screen. Let's enable a previously defined mapping rule for the cards on this page. We can instantly see how this mapping rule now creates a big card for every fourth item on the screen, a much nicer layout. Let's go ahead and save this change. then activate pre-flight so we can quickly preview all of our changes in a test copy of our app. Let's switch back over to our app and check out all of our updates. First, we'll navigate to our latest innovations articles. We see an update is available and bingo, our new layout is now there, much better. Let's tap into that article that we updated. Sure enough, we can see the new image and text. Now let's look at the product catalog. The top row contains the three new products that we imported from our PIM system. Great! 
Okay, this should give you a good overview of how AM Mobile can help you create and manage apps with real business impact. For more information, please contact your Adobe representative.